In order to improve the lives of people living with a rare disease, together with policies, we also need research. It's a great pleasure to announce this year's scientific awardee. Professor Alan Hovnanian, Professor Hovnanian has demonstrated scientific excellence and outstanding de dedication to the rare disease community. His work in rare skin diseases is admirable, especially for epidermolosis bullosa and pachyonychia congenita. By collaborating with scientists, clinicians and patients, he has advanced research and created the basis for the development of future therapies. His scientific leadership and collaborative spirit are an inspiration and make him a truly deserving recipient of this award. Let's hear from Professor Havnanian now. I would like to thank Eurordis for selecting me for the Black Pearl Scientific Award. This is a very prestigious award and I'm very honored to receive it. I started working on severe genetic diseases of the skin almost 30 years ago when I met a girl who was affected with a terrible skin disease I never heard of before. Her skin was so fragile that it would come off with the slightest friction leaving her covered with blisters and open wounds. I was shocked by this image of a suffering child, which I have never since forgotten. I was told that she was affected with a rare genetic disease called recessive dystrophic epidermolysis bullosa, known as RDB. There was no treatment. I thought that this was too unfair. Something had to be done to repair her skin and alleviate her suffering. At that moment, I decided to specialize in genetics. I couldn't imagine that this quest for a treatment was going to take the next 30 years of my life. It has been quite a long and challenging odyssey which has met several hurdles. Our key progress over the years has been to develop a new treatment for RDB using grafts of autologous skin equivalents genetically corrected with a safe retroviral vector expressing type 7 collagen which is defective in RDB. This approach holds great promise since it allows permanent correction of the grafted areas. A first clinical trial has started to treat adult patients in Paris. Important progress also includes the identification of the genetic basis for Darius disease, Hele Hele disease, Netherton syndrome, and a subtype of very severe palmoplantar keratoderma. We have performed detailed omics studies to better understand the pathogenesis of these diseases, which now lead us to propose specific or repurposed treatments. I have always been actively engaged with the patient community, which has always supported and valued my work, has provided motivation and guidance in my research. I would like to thank in particular patient associations such as Debra France, Debra International and Debra UK, EB Therapeutics, which is funding our current EB clinical trial, EB Research Partnership, as well as associations for Pachyonychia congenita, Bleu Coeur au Pied, Darie and Hele Hele disease, Afreda, and Ichthyosis, Association Ichthyos France. The next steps will be to use gene corrected skin equivalents to treat larger skin surfaces in a large number of adults and in children with RDB. We also aim to translate exon skipping to the clinic through the systemic delivery of oligonucleotides with an improved chemistry to treat cutaneous and mucous lesions of RDB people. Translation to the clinic of a highly potent and specific calicrine 5 inhibitor, which we have characterized, has a great potential to treat people with Netherton syndrome as well as biologics targeting interleukin-17 and other cytokines. 
treatment of Darius disease, Hele Hele disease and severe palmoplantar keratoderma with small molecules targeting early stages of the disease pathways should provide a new avenue for the treatment of these very disabling conditions with high unmet medical need. Alleviating the suffering of people with rare genetic skin diseases has been the engagement of my professional life. I very much hope that I will be able to make this grail become a reality through ongoing and future clinical trials with the trust and support from the rare disease community. Congratulations, Professor. And I know we all want a copy of that Binky's book over his shoulder, don't we? You are such an inspiration to the EB community and others.